Okay, this is proof that I have cleaned up my room and rearranged everything. I am so happy. It took me actually three days, so I wanted this to document what it looked like. Before, hopefully, I mess it up again. Not too much, though. I'll try not to. Anyway, that bag under there is just full of amp covers. Vintage ones, new ones, uh, ones that go with the amps. Finally cleaned off my desk, got all my tools, screwdrivers, guitar adjustment tools, everything stashed away. It's in here, just can't see it. I got the Leslie back in here after I did that video. And I uh, thought the Leslie sounded pretty cool. And the driving amp is up underneath that stand there's the vibra verb now this is new I think I haven't even played it yet but I've got one basement in that corner 45 degrees another the other basement in this corner 45 degrees so they're spread apart there's the 64 super reverb well, one improvement was I got all my guitars out of the way they were just kind of leaning up against everything probably my guitar stand there's my effects uh, board. I still actually need to hook all this up and try to make it as neat as possible. Band master. This is my super audio and I don't know if you guys remember but way back in the day Sony invented this high def uh, digital format and it really sounds great. I mean that's why it's got double subs, the black subs uh, definitive, no, yeah, definitive speakers, really good. But, uh, all these CDs right up at the top row, those are all super audio. Anything from the Who to Beethoven. And so, I am super happy. I just had to share this with everybody because... It was hard work. I got all the boxes off the top, all the dust. I took these things down from the ceiling and dusted them. Ah, the room is in good shape. There's that picture I showed you guys on another video. Oh, yeah. Put my two Stevie Ray photos up. That one and that one. Yeah, just like everybody. I am, and used to be more of a Stevie Ray fanatic. I think I switched over to Hendrix. But, uh, here's my box of tubes. Power tubes on top, preamp tubes on the bottom. Those boxes are full, not up with all good tubes. Believe me, most of them are junk. That's it. Uh, next time we'll listen to see if it sounds better. Talk to you later.